I'm Daniela Kouye. In this week's Spotlight, the focus is on three stock gems that were sold down in the reporting season and are now looking interesting. This reporting season was notable for extreme volatility in share prices as analysts and investors reassess the results, expectations and forecast guidance or the lack thereof for the next 12 months. Three stocks that were sold off and are now offering attractive entry points according to the experts are WiseTech Global, a global software provider for the logistics businesses and a tech darling. Amcor PLC, a world leading packaging company and ResMed, the best in class and global leader of sleep apnea products and services. WiseTech Global was caught up in AI hype and the stock rallied from $48 at the beginning of the year to a record high of $88 before the results. Results were a bit weaker than expected and guidance was downgraded. EBITDA for full year 24 to full year 26 have come down by minus 12 to minus 10% and revenue guidance by minus 4 to minus 6%. Margins were also downgraded for the integration of two recent lower margin acquisitions. And integration of ChatGPT will benefit the business and there is an estimated $40 million cost out. Refinitiv has one strong buy, seven buys, six holds and one sell, and a target price of $73.50. Now this compares to FN Arena with an average price target of $77.03, with Ord Manette and Accumulate, and a robust price target of $95 per share. The second stock is Amcor, which suffered major headwinds from the pandemic as large retailers like Walmart and Costco moved to a just-in-case inventory model versus just-in-time. Inventory levels built up, which have been declining over the last 12 months. Wilson sees the destocking and cost disinflation as positives for Amcor and they expect the company to grow earnings at 7% per annum through full year 24 to full year 27. The stock is currently trading at the lower end of historical valuations and the stock is expected to re-rate with an attractive 5% yield. FN Arena has an average target price of $15.46 compared to the share price of $15 and Refinitiv has one buy, four holds and three sell recommendations. ResMed's fourth quarter results were slightly lower than market expectations and the stock tumbled 20% on the day. Although revenue growth has been sustained, costs continue to impact on profits. The greater issue for the stock has been the short sellers, which have jumped on the narrative that the new weight loss drugs from Nova Nordisk and Eli Lilly, notably Azempic and Monjaro, have the potential to take market share away from ResMed. Now, experts have confirmed that obesity is not the main driver of sleep apnea and, accordingly, the sell-off appears to be well overdone. Refinitiv has four strong buys and five buys and six holds and no sells. The FN Arena price target is $36.57 versus current, the share price currently around $25. And this is your Investor Spotlight for today. I will see you next week.